Hey guys, what's going on? Today, I'll be rebuilding the Chicago Bulls. Now the Bulls, you're probably thinking, they only rebuilding. They're a win-now team. That is true, but if they don't win this year, then what? Everyone's gonna get older. Chris Hall will be 35, Rose will be 27, Noel will be 30, Butler will be 26. You know, Gibson will be 30. Like, they're, they're old. <laughs> They're an old team, but they're a young team as well, if that makes any sense, but what I'm going to do is I want to keep Butler, Beretic, and McDermott. Those three guys we keep, but everyone else I'm pretty much going to trade. Yes, you heard that right. I'm going to trade Gasol. I'm trading Rose. I'm trading Noah. So let's get right into it. I want some draft picks to start off with, so let's go with Philadelphia. See what they want for their first overall pick. Well, not first overall, but their first round pick. Don't want to trade Paul Gasol for that. No. Butler, Gasol, no, okay, no, um, let's try the Wizards, what do they want for the first, over, the first round pick here, they want, my, no, Jim Butler, no, Mike didn't leave my first rounder, that's not bad, actually, Paul Gasol, okay, I want this to do with Mike Levy trade, so Jim Levy, my first round for the Wizards, and Chris Humphrey's done, Excellent. okay, now, let's keep going here, Let's see who else. Let's go to the Bucks. The Bucks usually do bad as well. Let's see the Bucks' first uh, round pick. They have Rose, Jimmy Butler, Mertich, Gasol. Okay. Let's see. Rose, my first round did no. These guys are crazy. Okay. Uh, who else is this? Let's go Celtics. Let's see how they do. Celtics' first round pick. Who they want? Mertich. Jimmy Butler, Pau Gasol, Joakim Noah. Let's give him Joakim Noah and my second round pick for Celtics and Gerald Walls. Why not? I'm not gonna trade Gerald Walls because his contract is terrible. I don't think anyone wants that deal. Okay, let's go to the Bulls here. Gerald Wallace, where are you? $10 million. <laughs> wow, no thanks. Nobody take my second round pick, please. I can get Grant Jarrett, whoever you are. <laughs> uh, Wilson Chandler, Omar Sheik, Curry Martin, Chuck Hayes, Trevor Reza. Okay, so I can't get pretty much anyone. Let's try this again. Let's see if it offers up there. I'll throw in uh, throw in Aaron Brooks. Jarrett Wallace and Aaron Brooks, two scrubs. Let's see what I can get for these guys here. I'm not sure my first round pick, so. I can get Andre Miller and Jason Thompson. My goodness. Jose Calderon, jeez, terrible. Jameer Nelson is off the books off this year, and Joffrey Laverne, try butchering that name. Derek Tishon Prince, Griffiths Vasquez, Corey Brewer, Iggy. You know what? Let's go get this. Um, no, not Tishon Prince. Let's do this uh, Jameer Nelson and Joffrey Laverne trade. Why not? Okay, done deal. Nice. This is rotation here, so I got Butler, Rose, Miritich, Kate Gibson. So, still more work to do here. Not done. Nowhere near done yet. What can I get for Pau Gasol here? I want to free up Miritich, make him the starting power forward. So, I'll actually I'll trade Gasol and Gibson. Let's see what I can get for those two guys. This should be juicy. John Henson, just Thompson, Paul Millsap. Piombo favors Gay, no, Vucevic, Rondo, DeWest, Monroe, Mir Johnson. So, pretty much nothing. That's pretty sad. That's pretty sad. Can't trust me. Let's try uh, Rose. Rose and Heinrich. Give me something good here, please. Nerlens Noel. I might do that. MCW and John Henson, two young guys. That's not too bad either. Randolph, not the XM and Gordon Hayward. Now with we'll those contracts, Vucevic and Alfred Payton. I'll throw my first round pick though. I lost it. Roy Hibbert, Kyle Lowry, Demar Derozan. Interesting. Eric Bledsoe, Nikola Pekovic. No, no, no. Do I get none of those? No. Let's get the Romans Dole. Derek Rose and Kirk Heinrich for Tony Roten and Romans Dole. Done deal. You guys might think I'm crazy, but maybe I am. 
So here's our starting five right now. Roten, Butler, Miritich, Gasol, and Noel. Okay, so more work to be done. Let's go trade Paul Gasol and Taj Gibson. Please give me something decent here. No more of this crap. I can't Jabari Parker. Isaiah Thomas, Paul Millsap, Dragon, Lance Stevenson. I'll make it Lance Stevenson. The Jazz first round pick. And I get Derek Favors as well. I might do that. It's pretty much the same guys being traded, being offered for. Look at this. So, I'm going to do this uh, Jazz thing here. Is that straight? I'll get their first their first round pick and Derek Favors. I'll, I'll trade Derek Favors after that. Oh, jeez. What I do? What I do? Okay. Uh, so, Derek Favors. And I'll throw in... God. Nazi Ma... <laughs> Nazi Muhammad, why not? So I can get a bunch of guys. Nothing really good here. I get Trey Burke. Tobias Harris. Hmm, that's not bad. Terry Evans, Mer Johnson, Boris Dio, Danny Granger, Vaca, Kevin Garnett. Let's get Tobias Harris. So Tobias Harris and Channing Fry, all four. Channing Fry is a horrible deal. No one's gonna take that deal, man. You know what? Somebody will. Let's do it. Tobias Harris, welcome to the team. We take Channing Fry's horrible, horrible salary as well. So let's get rid of Channing Fry now, because I don't want that on the books. No chance of keeping that. Channing Fry. Four years, thirty-two million. What were they thinking? I can get a Jazz second round pick. Oh jeez. Everybody wants my first round. Okay, let's make this more juicy for them. Um, let's throw in Tony Snell. It's Tony Snell and Channing Fry. I can get Ish Smith and Jay Rich. That's not a bad deal. Jeff Green, Kemba Walker. Jason Smith, Jordan Hill, Ben Gordon, Jerk Jack, no, nothing good here. Karam Butler, Tyler Hansborough, Patty Mills, Gary Neal. Okay, I'm going to do this Ish Smith and uh, Jerry Stride. Done deal. Let's see this rotation here now. Tony Roten, Jimmy Butler, Tobias Harris, Nikola Meritich, and Nerlens Dole. With a, a decent bench, I guess. Okay, so let's get right into it. Let's go see my uh, my teammate chemistry. We're at 66%. Team overall is 82. I'm going to submit the entire season, and I'll see you guys in a couple minutes. So LeBron James got MVP. Alfred Payton got Rookie of the Year. Aaron Gordon got Six Man. DeAndre Jordan got Defensive Player of the Year. Andre Drummond got Most Improved. And David Black, a coach of the year. Now, somehow, we made the playoffs. And we got the third seed. Now, I say somehow because we traded Derrick Rose. We traded Joakim Noah. And we traded Pau Gasol. And we still got, you know, the third seed in the East. I really don't understand that. But anyways, <laughs> let me show you how our season went here. Leading the way home. So we got 10th best record in the NBA, 44 and 38. Our offense was 15th, but our defense was 12. So leading the way was Jimmy Butler with almost 28 and 5. Tobias Harris with almost 17, 8 and 3. Tony Roten had 14, 3 and 4. Meritage at 12 and 8. Nurun's Dole at 10 and 9. And that's pretty much it. Okay, so I'm not going to expect much here in the first round. I'm mean, sorry, in our first year in a rebuilding project here, but let's see how we do against the six seeded Toronto Raptors. So, game one, here we go. We take game one and game two. Oh, Raptors take game three. They tie it up at four. 
We take game five. We're going to game seven. And we beat the Raptors in seven. Wow, okay. Okay, now up next we're playing the Miami Heat in the second round. Let's see how we do here. Game one. Miami takes game one. And game two. Oh boy. And game three. Man, bring out the brooms. Miami swept us in four. Okay. So the rest of the way. And Miami ended up winning the championship. They beat the Rockets in seven. Somehow they swept Cleveland. Wow, okay. So Miami wins the championship. Beat the Rockets in seven. Finals MVP is Dwayne Wade, averaging 16, 5, and 4. Players retiring are Vince Carter, Chris Anderson, Nazi Muhammad, Ray Allen, Tim Duncan, KG. Going to the Hall of Fame are Carter, Allen, Nash, Garnett, and Duncan. There's the player progression. Everyone's going up nicely here. Except these guys are all old and on the decline. I'll probably trade them anyways. Okay, so we only have we only have one draft pick in the lottery. That's fantastic. The 0.8% chance to get in the first round pick. That's just great. Great. So here's the countdown. At 14, we got T Wolves, then the Clippers. Nuggets. Okay, we got the 11th pick. All right. Patriots got the first overall pick. So, oh, I do have three picks in the first round. I'm gonna try to make a jump in the uh, the draft here. Staff, I think a team player options. Get into it here. Jermaine Nelson. He uh, declined it. That's good. What I'm going with Etwan Moore. Uh, I don't want to pay that million dollars. I'm, no thanks. They're gone. Big names declining are Jordan Hill and Wilson Chandler, so nobody. Qualifying offers, Tobias Harris and Jim Butler, hell yes, both of them. Okay, Butler's leaving, Tobias Harris is leaving. Oh my goodness, it's not good. Okay, NBA draft, let's get right into it. I have four picks overall, three in the first round. I'm gonna try to trade up. So let's see what I can get from my draft picks here. I gotta move up for sure. What can I get for, let's say, all three of them? All my first rounders. What can I get? I get Kirk Heinrich. Really, bro? Danny, I want this crap. I want to take the first, second, or third, or fourth, you know? Something high. Second round. What is this garbage? What is this crap? Okay, let's try this again. Um, I'm gonna try my my 24th, my 17th. What can I get for those two picks there? I don't want a second round pick. I want to higher up. I get the 20th. Yippee. Second. Oh man. Paul Pierce. This is nothing good here. This is a joke. We get the 21st pick. Okay, let's try something different here. Let's try the 11th and the 17th. Gotta be top 10, top 8, pr preferably. I don't want Covington, Dudley. Like, this, is, this is terrible. Nobody wants to get rid of their first pick, or second pick, or third, you know. Okay. So let's see what they want for their picks. Because their teams here are playing hardball. Here we go. Six overall pick. What does Charlotte Hornets want for their pick? Norman's no, no thanks. Tony Roten, Meyer 11th and 24th. Uh, okay. Chris, I'm, I'm not trading Norman's no. No chance in hell. Moving on. Oh, okay, we got the Knicks with the fifth overall pick. We got Meritich on my 24th. No. No, I'm not trading Meritich. They want Meritich in every trade. You guys are crazy. On to the next one. The second overall pick. Okay, what do the Lakers want? Lawrence Dole. I'm not trading Lawrence Dole, people. Sorry. Okay, what else is there? Seventh overall pick, the Pelicans. From my 11th to my 17th. Okay, Mertich. No, for some reason, no. Um. 
this deal here, actually. No. Uh, should I do this trade? Roten, my 11th, and Jeffrey Laverne for Brian Roberts and my 7th. For the 7th of Brian Roberts. Ah. Man, I want to do this. Okay, what else is there? Who else is out there? Will the trade their top picks? Third overall pick, Milwaukee Bucks. Miritich, no. Tony Roten. Everybody wants Miritich. For some reason, well, no, no way I'm letting him go. Not that easy. Okay, so I'm getting, I'm getting very impatient here. Let's try this again. Let's go with the Hornets for six pick. Don't let's go, no. I'm not doing that either. Chris Humphreys. Chris Humphreys? Really, bruh? What if I just give him Chris Humphreys and my 11th for the 6th? Okay, let's go to Charlotte here. Where are the Hornets? I want their 6th pick. I'll trade Chris Humphreys. And... Well, well, okay, hold on. Troy Daniels. Oh, jeez. Okay, for the first round pick, I'll give you Tony Roten. Straight up. Counter offer, of course. I don't want... I'm not doing this. You guys are crazy. Ah, oh, man. These people here are pissing me off. What about pisses the wild for an eighth pick? Meritage, of course. I wanted to do this trade actually. Roten, Joffrey Laverne, and the seven, my 17th pick for James Johnson the Wraith. I'll do that. Done deal. Okay, what else do I have right now? So, what do I have left for what picks? Do I have an 8th and 11th, I think? Yeah, so let's, I'll trade the 8th and 11th. We're looking here for those two picks. Maybe top 5, hopefully. Like, why do I. Well, just take this then. Why would I trade my 11th and my 8th for Jared Bayless? Why would I do... I'm getting mad. I'm getting mad now. I can get the second overall pick. I can get the second overall pick. This is terrible. This is absolutely brutal. Okay, so screw this. I'm done. I'm done trading. Let's go right to the draft here. So it's my pick now at the 8th spot. Let's see who is available. Okay, so I can get Kelly Oubre. Jaleel Okafor is still available. But I already have Nerlens Noel. So my team needs here are as follows. I have no point guards, no shooting guards, a couple small forwards. I got Meritich and I got Nerlens Noel. Okay. Two spots, so let's go right into it. I need a point guard. No, no, jeez. Almost screwed up there. Okay, nothing. No point guards left. Shooting guard, I can get Garcia or RJ Hunter. Small four, I can get Kelly Obre. Obre, sorry, or Stanley Johnson. Let's go Kelly Obre. Actually, Stanley Johnson. Let's go Stanley Johnson. Okay. We have small four, so we got one. So we got Stanley Johnson. Now I just gotta wait till I get to my 11th pick. So it's my turn once again at the 11th pick. And I kind of want to take Jaleel Okafor. But I already have Meritich and Noel. Trust get Kelly Obre. Okay, Persingas. You know what? Oh man. Decisions, decisions. Is it between Obre or Okafer? Oh uh, man, what do I do? I'm gonna go Kelly Obre. Why not? So I got one, one more pick left at 24 spot. Just hang in tight. I'll get back to you guys in a bit until we get to that spot. So once again, it's my, my pick. 24th pick in the first round. Let's see who's still out there. I can still get Cliff Alexander. Or Christos Przingis or Matreos Harrell. So I'm going with the best the best 
prospects out there. I'm going Cliff Alexander. Why not? What a steal at number 24. So now I'm going to submit the rest of the way. I have one more pick in the second round. I'll let the assistant GM do that for me. Let's see who they got. Second round here. Where's the Bulls? We got Yogi Ferrell. We need a point guard. We got one. Okay. So let's go on rookie signing. So all my picks, of course. Now I have $40 million to work with. $40 million. That's ridiculous. I can get DeAndre. Oh, man. <laughs> I need a point guard, though. Let's get DeAndre. I'm gonna I'll probably trim after. For a point guard, hopefully. What else can I get? I can get Paul Millsap. Let's get Millsap as well. That's a couple of Okay, let's get Greg Moore. Uh, Jimmy Butler. Okay, where's Butler going? Actually, do I even need Butler anymore? Probably not, eh? Okay, so I can get Brendan Knight. Why not? Be a point guard for me. And let's go for one more signing here. Josh Smith. You're not going to be a starter. You're going to be a sixth man for me. Okay, decline my offer. That's a uh, cool story, bro. All right. Let's try to get Josh Smith again. I'll give you a no trade clause. There we go. I feel about that. Okay, let's see what I did here. Anyone agree to my signings? Paul Millsap, we got him. We got Paul Millsap. We got Jim Butler. The Suns match my offer for Brendan Nice. We need to get him. Who's next? Do we get DeAndre? We got DeAndre and uh, Jer Jer Smith. Jer Josh Smith. We got both of them. Okay, okay. We still have $4.8 million left. Let's get someone else. Someone cheap here. Let's fill the bench. Why is Tobias Harris not signing with us? Why oh, yeah, that's too much money? He doesn't want to come back anyways. Okay. Let's get a uh, point guard here. Anyone decent out there? Hey, Kendall Marshall. Maybe Corey Joseph. Why not? Someone cheap. Something a little... Give me a player option. Why not? Oh, my roster's full. Okay. Let's use on my roster here. Uh, you know what? I'm going to keep it as is. That's fine. So let's go right into the next season here. Advance the next year. Let's simulate past the free agency. Past the training camps. And let's see where we are in the uh, preseason power rankings. With all these signings, I'm pretty sure we're our top 10. Top 5, hopefully. We got some experience. We got some youngins. We should have monster heroes here. Stanley Johnson, Kelly, Cliff Alexander, Kelly Oubre, we're beasting right now. So, of course, Thunder top the preseason rankings. Durant, Westbrook, and, you know, Abaka can't handle that. But we are, okay, we're down there. Wow, we're 14th, really? I thought we'd been better than that. So, let's see this rotation here. That's why. Our point guard is terrible. Okay, so, oh, man. I gotta trade Josh Smith. He's not a star. On, he's not my star on Smart Forward, please. I got these two young guns right here. I have some work to do still here, guys. So hold on. Bear with me. Trade Nolan's Noel. Miritich and McDermott. Now we're talking. We should get a decent point guard here. Give me something good here, please. Isaiah Cannon, of course. Zachary Randolph, no. Matt Stevenson, don't want you. Victor Oladipo. D. Will, Ty Lawson. Emmanuel Moutier. Jennings, Lou Will, Monroe. Carl Towns. Well, my goodness. Where's some point guards at? Try this again. Try to get different offers this time around. Let's see if that works out. My, my advantage here. And my offers are... <sighs> wow, same crap. Randolph Teague, Goran Dragic, Kemba Walker, Larry Sanders, Odipo, Brook Lopez, wow. Josh Smith, he doesn't want to go though, so I can't get rid of him. Ty Lawson, and Randy Ford. No one's Noel, you guys crazy man? Oh wait, <laughs> I'm dumb, I'm trading No one's Noel. Whoops, okay, hello brain fart there. Uh, Kyle Lowry. 
Josh Miller just get winning. Carl Towns, Pekovich. Okay, I look so I'm, I'm screwed here then. Looks like I'm getting screwed. One last time. I, I gotta make a trade here. I have to make a trade. I need a point guard. Like, something has to get done here. Crowley, Randolph, Keith. It's all the same guys. Trey Burke. Alfred Payton and Paul Pierce. D. Will. He has a nice expiring contract. And Jabari Bird. Ty Lawson. Manuel Moody. Yeah. It's not a bad trade, actually. Okay, let's go after. Let's get Emmanuel Moutier. Nice young prospect there. Let's do this trade. Okay. So, this rotation now looking pretty good. Emmanuel Moutier, Jimmy Butler, Kelly Oubre, Paul Millsap, and DeAndre Jordan. A mix of some experience and some young talent. I'm liking this team. So let's go right to the calendar. Let's start to do some simulating here. Chemistry is at 53%. Our overall is at 86. Nice jump from last year. So let's go right to the season awards here after them simulating. I don't want Evan Turner. Okay, guys. Hang in tight. I'll be back in a bit. So, of course, of course LeBron got MVP. We got Emmanuel Moutier, and he is the Rookie of the Year. Shabazz Napier won six man. Anthony Davis, of course, got the Defensive Player of the Year. Kent Bazemore got most improved, and David Black again won Coach of the Year. So we get the second seed in the East now, did better than last year. And this is how our season went. We went 49 and 33. Offense was one of the worst. It's at 18th, but our defense was fourth. Jim Butler led the way with 22 points, almost eight boards and four assists. Millsap at 17 and seven. Murier at 12, almost six and seven. Josh Bell at 11, 5, and 3. DeAndre at 9, 10, and 2 blocks. And the rookies chipped in a little bit. Don't improve over a couple of years. So, let's go right into the playoffs here. Game 1 of the first round. We're playing the Magic. Here we go. They take Game 1. And Game 2. And Game 3. And we got swept in the first round to the 7th seeded Magic. That's just fantastic. And your NBA champions are the Miami Heat. I think again? Did they win last time? Did they beat OKC again in 7? Wow. Okay. Chris Bosh is your MVP. 18, 9. Retired players are Mike Miller, Paul Pierce, Manu Ginobili, David West, and Tayshaun Prince. Paul Pierce going to the Hall of Fame. And player pro Look at him. Player progression. Look at Manuel Moutier. Went up six, great, six overall points. That's crazy. Uber went up. Alexander went up. Josh Smith going down. That's good. It's great. These two guys are out of here, anyways. Okay. So we have no lottery picks. So let's go right into team player options here. Chris Humphries will decline you, and Farrell is PO'd, so he's gone as well. Dwight Howard's a big game declining. Qualifying offers have none. My free agents, nobody really important. Let's go right into rookie signing here. I got one draft pick. Let's sign him. I got almost $15 million to work with here in free agency. I need a center, right? Okay, so I can't get the way Howard. Can't afford him. That's way too much money. The cheaper option is Al Horford, though. Wait. What our team need here? Team needs. We got decent point guard. Shooting guard's alright. Actually, we can use a shooting guard. Small forwards are good. Power forwards are good. Okay, so... I'm looking to sign the best guy available that wants to come to my team here. I can get Kobe. Let's get Bradley Beal, actually. Bradley Beal. Let's sign you. Do you want to come to Chicago, Bradley? Okay, so think about it. He's coming. I have a feeling he's coming. Wow, the Wizards matched my offer. That's fantastic. I can get Damian Lillard? He doesn't want to come at all, eh? I'll give you a player option. How'd that sound? Can we get Lillard? Can we get... Oh, wow, the ma they matched my offer. 
I can get Colby. For dirt cheap. We're probably gonna be a six man. Oh, well, you'll play whatever. I'll give you a player option. Just because you're Colby. I'll sign Lance Stevenson as well. You'll be a starter, though. Okay, let's see if I can get both those guys. I got Colby. I got Colby. Okay. Can I get Lance as well? I got Lance Stevenson. I got Lance Stevenson. Nice. Okay. So, let's go right into next year then. So surprisingly, the Grizzlies start the power rankings in the number one spot, and we are. Wow, we're down there. We're 15 still. No one is giving us any appreciation, any credit. It's probably because everyone's pissed off. Look at this. Everyone's negative. Everyone's minus. This is not too good. This is not good at all, guys. Our team, <laughs> our team chemistry is zero, but our team overall is 86. So let's simulate right through the whole year and get back to you guys in a little bit. So, again, LeBron got MVP. Jonathan Kerr got Rookie of the Year. Ricky Westfall got six, man. Andre Drummond had a monster year. He won a Defensive Player of the Year. Bryce Johnson got Most Improved. And our coach, Tom Thibodeau, got Coach of the Year with the best record in the league. So, as you can see, we're the one seed in the East. Let's go see how our season went here. So, as again... Best record in the league, 56-26. Offense was 13th, yep, but defense was first. Leading the way was Paul Millsap with 18-8. Colby at 17-5-4. Jim Butler at 17-7-4. Emmanuel Moody at 11-6-6. Lance Stevenson at 9-5-3. DeAndre at 9-11, two blocks. And the bench did play pretty well as well. So here we go, game one of the Western, oh sorry, the Eastern Conference Seven Finals. We're playing the Raptors in the first round. Hope we get a sweep here. We take game one, and game two, and game three, and game four. Okay, let's go on the next round here. We're playing the Indiana Pacers. Here we go, game one. We take game one, and game two. And game three. Oh, they take game four. And game five. Oh boy. We take game six, and we're playing the Cleveland Cavaliers in the Eastern Conference Finals. Game one. Bulls, Cavs. Let's do this. We take game one. And game two. And game three. Cavs take game four. And game five. Come on, finish them off. We finish off the Cavs in six. On to the NBA Finals. Huge matchup. OKC against Chicago. Game one of the NBA Finals. Here we go. OKC takes game one. We take game two. And game three. And game four. And the Chicago Bulls are your NBA champions. We beat the OKC Thunder in five games. And our finals MVP is Emmanuel Moutier of all people with 11, 6, and 6. Wow. Players retiring. Kobe <laughs> retires a champion. And so Kyle Corver and Devin Harris also retires. Doc Rivers retires as a coach. Kobe's going to the Hall of Fame. Let's go visit the White House.
and give it up for your 2017 NBA champions, the Chicago Bulls. What a historic season we had. Amazing year. Thanks for watching, guys. As always, I enjoy doing this. Let me know in the comments down below what team I should do next. And until next time, guys, thanks for watching. Take it easy.